Hey y'all, Grind Rising. Today we're going to start off with some tea. Let's see what does the collective need to be aware of. Okay. Okay. We have here defamation of character. Somebody's out here talking shit about you, trying to make you look bad. Okay. And we have here uh, moving silence. It says, do not interrupt their karma, fall back. Okay, so, this could be somebody that, uh, maybe you work with them, maybe this is a friend, it's a family member, and Spirit is telling you here, yeah, look, they could be facing judgment in court, and this is a test, or they're facing judgment, they're getting karma, and Spirit is saying, do not interrupt. So, this is somebody that maybe, you know, maybe you wasn't expecting them to be talking shit about you, you know, um... If you, if you, if spirit is telling you don't interrupt their karma, that means that this is somebody who's probably a friend, family member, somebody that maybe you'll be looking out for them. And spirit is telling you, you got to let whatever's going to happen to them happen to them because they're about to get some karma. And the reason why is because, yeah, look, it's a test. Again, it came out. Yeah. The reason why is because they was defaming your character. They was doing something behind your back. All right. It says here, let go. All right. You cannot control this. All right. You cannot control people talking shit you cannot control you know people turning their their backs on you or backstabbing you or whatever it is here this is this is a test all right you cannot control it you gotta let go you gotta let god handle this all right don't try to help this person yeah this is a crab in a bucket i'm telling you you try to help this person they're gonna pull you down with them all right and that could be again why they were talking shit about you because you could be making moves yeah look we got here it's a trap exactly don't help this person because it's, they're gonna pull you down with them all right yeah staying in a bad situation exactly this is what this person is going to do they're going to keep you in a, in a bad situation and a low vibration with them so you just you know whenever you get this news about this uh situation this confirmation whatever like when you get this confirmation just uh let it play out all right don't try to help this person all right maybe you're going to hear that they going through something financially or some shit. Or maybe somebody going to pass away or some shit around them. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Sorry for your loss. Keep it pushing. All right? But Spirit is letting you know right now that the reason why is because they did something to you on behind the scenes. All right? And it, and it, and it got to be more than defamation of character. But we're going to keep going and see what else. Yeah, this person is a con artist. Okay, they acting like they fuck with you, like they your family, friend, whatever, and they um or lover, and they moving funny behind your back. All right, it says here it won't it won't stay like this forever. So spirit is telling you, you know, just keep moving forward. Exactly, this is why because karma's here. Okay, it's coming in. All right, and again, let go of what you cannot control. So don't try to control this situation. All right, just yeah, let it be a surprise for this person. Don't try to warn nobody or none of that. Let it be. Okay. Let's see. Tell me more. Wow. Spirit is saying they're blocked from your energy. Okay? That's what Spirit is saying. You better not help this person. We're over here doing all this shit behind the scenes. We're about to serve them their karma, and we don't need you to interrupt this. Okay? <laughs> Somebody got their body done. Or this person could be telling people that you got your body done. Uh, you know, like you got some type of cosmetic surgery or you got some type of surgery on your body to, you know, uh, to enhance your beauty. You know, you like maybe you got your titties done, your booty done, whatever. All right. Either you did or this person is telling people that. It says here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, okay? This could be you or this could be this person that we're talking about or somebody that's involved here. And Spirit is saying that you're better off without this energy, okay? Yeah, this energy is broken, busted, and they are troubled, okay? They do nothing but trouble and they're going to be troubled. They're going to have a lot of problems, all right? We have something about social media here. Somebody going to get arrested. And we got worldwide recognition. So you could be having worldwide recognition on social media if you do something uh, online. All right, we have reverse, back to sender. So, yeah, they probably don't want you to 
to get this worldwide recognition you know they are trying to distract you see here it says here you're getting distracted focused they're trying to distract you they're trying to uh defame your character and this person is yeah look trying to block your blessings so this person's gonna end up getting locked up that could be this this karma for them and more all right let's keep going so you know if it's a rest if it's a rest don't go and bail them out you know what i'm saying like just mind your business all right but spirit wants you to know what's going on all right we have a group chat so they could be having conversations about you in the group chat all right spirit is saying they just don't want you to be happy again a crab in a bucket this person they didn't do nothing with their life so they don't want you to do nothing with your life they don't want you to succeed they don't want you to get this worldwide recognition you know this is something that's going to probably be on the local news for some of y'all we got cheated here somebody's cheating all right they sealed their fate Let me more <coughs> okay. All right, spirit. What else does the collective need to know? Somebody's pregnant and they cheated, <laughs> or maybe they cheated with somebody and they got pregnant. Tell me more about this. Oh, hmm. with a karmic friend, somebody could have cheated with somebody's fake friend, all right, that could be a, a side note, or maybe this is the person who's getting karma, okay, and they're getting karma because they cheated on you, they're lying about you, whatever, we have a new city, and we have north node, north node on your birth chart is what you're supposed to be doing here, your purpose, so somebody's purpose is in a new city, somebody needs to move out of the current city that they're in, uh, you could already be planning to do that. This is your confirmation or spirit is letting you know like somebody needs to move You know, you got to get out of your comfort zone, you know in this city that you're in now It's too much toxicity going on too much lying, you know, whatever's going on. It's just your comfort zone and it's time to get out of there All right Trying to catch you alone. So yeah, again, in, in this city you win too much toxicity. They probably know that you, you know, maybe you be alone or something and somebody could be trying to catch you alone or they were trying to do this and it's not going to work. All right. It says here, this movie has a message for you or that movie has a message for you. Somebody's going to watch a movie or you already saw a movie and it's going to come to your head right now. And it's about something like this situation right here. All right. That's for somebody. All right, or you're gonna watch a movie that's gonna that you're gonna be like, oh shit, this is like the reading, okay? It's a surrender control. So again, you know, maybe you try to control things, you know, by keeping these connections alive, you know, uh, keep on looking out for these people, helping them out, even though behind the scenes, unknowingly to you, these people are wishing on your downfall. All right, so spirit is saying, stop trying to control everything, stop trying to control these connections, stop trying to keep these people in your life. You know, it's time to let go and let God, all right? Because they're protecting you from this energy. Yeah, deny access. Again, you got to let go, let God, and deny access. Don't let this person back into your life because they're sending shit towards you to stop you, all right? So everybody's saying you deserve it all, you know? They're trying to block you from getting everything that you deserve because they're a hater, and that shit ain't going to work, all right? So we have communicate. So this person might try to communicate with you, they might try to get back into your life or whatever the situation is here. And Spirit is telling you, there's a lesson to learn. Exactly. There's a lesson to learn here. This is a karmic connection. And you need to just focus on your higher calling, your north node, your purpose, and leave this energy in the past. Okay? Because you have a higher calling. You got shit to do. All right? Again, this is a lesson. All right? We got two to four weeks. We have consequences. And Spirit is telling you here to change your diet Eat more fruits, drink more water, okay, uh, to, uh, you know, become more healthier and, you know, be in balance, you know, heal. This is going to help you to raise your vibration. Again, you got a higher calling. You got something to do here, all right? So we're really trying to prepare you for that. So that's what they want you to focus on, yourself, your calling, your purpose, your healing. Prioritize yourself and leave this, this energy in the past because you're about to see a lot of shit pop off. Somebody going to get locked up. Somebody going to end up pregnant. Somebody going to be on the news. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So just get your popcorn is what I'm feeling. Like, you know, just get your popcorn and just shut out. All right. Yeah. Drama. Because these people are about to have a whole lot of drama. All right. We got a supervisor at work for some of y'all. 
for some of y'all is lovers and friends. Again, with this karmic friend, your lover could have been cheating. All right, you could have been in a marriage or an engagement leading to marriage or in a relationship, and this person cheated. All right, take what is for you because it's a group message. We got six weeks now. So the other one said two to four weeks, six weeks. All right, this is when you want to start to see shit pop off. All right, they cannot stop destiny. Exactly. This uh, blessing, this uh, manifestation that they're trying to block is going to come in for you. They cannot stop it because it's part of your destiny, part of your purpose. They're putting up a front. Exactly. There's a con artist, somebody who's acting like they fuck with you, like they love you, like they care about you. But in reality, they're plotting behind your back. You could be seeing these angel numbers. Letting you know that you are in alignment. Yeah, and they're trying to hold on to you. Trying to hold on and hold you back. What? Yeah, look, stuck. See what I'm saying? Look, domination spells. Exactly. Trying to dominate you. Trying to control you. All right? They're the ones that need to surrender control too. Shit. Yeah, look, because you're leveling up. They're trying to stop you from leveling up. All right? Y'all know in every reading, Spirit is showing us that the reason that they do these things is to keep us in a low vibration because they're trying to siphon our energy. They're trying to come up off of our energy somehow to manifest shit for themselves. They can manifest material material things, financial things for themselves with our energy. So they have to keep us in a low vibration. They send spells to attack us, to keep us stressed out. They send toxic people in our life. I know that this, this shit sounds crazy, but I'm telling you, some people do this shit. This world is more spiritual than it is physical. And the people that know that, know that they take advantage of the people who are ignorant to that, you know? So they know that you could do these type of things. They know that you could siphon people's energy. They know that you could steal from them in the spiritual. And that's what they're doing here. So this person is trying to block you so that they could continue to come up off of your energy and it's not going to work. You are going to continue to level up and they are going to get the consequences for doing that. All right. And it's going to be a surprise. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Surprise, bitch. You're going to be doing a, a, a lengthy amount of time. OK. Somebody's definitely going to prison. We see that they're going to get arrested and they're going to be doing time. OK. Here's your confirmation. All right. Here's your confirmation, y'all. Bottom of the deck, release what is not in alignment with your purpose. That's what you're doing here. Like I said, you have a higher calling. You got shit to do in this, in this planet, all right? And, and these people trying to hold you back from doing that. But they're not God. They're trying to play God in your life. They are not God, okay? So now God is about to humble them and show them who's God. Look, you see what I'm saying? Jail time. They're about to get humbled, bruh. Holding on. Exactly. They're trying to hold on to your energy, all right? For some of y'all, this is a lover, a karmic lover that I, I show you here. They're fucking around with your homie. All right, they got pregnant with the homie who's not really a homie. The, the, you know, the homie's a karmic friend. We got stepmother for some of y'all that's going to get their karma. Tell me more. Yeah, they're going to be stuck. All right, they're addicted to your energy. I'm telling you, they, it's like a... It's like a gambling thing to them, you know, like they just want, they're like, okay, we're going to, we're going to try to siphon off their energy one more time. Okay. We're going to keep doing it. For some of y'all, they, they could have been doing this for years. If it was family members, they could have been siphoning off your energy for years. And now shit is hitting the fan because now you are awakening. Now you are leveling up. Now is when the shit is breaking and they cannot handle it. They don't understand what's going on because they have been addicted to your energy. They have been siphoning off of your energy for so many years. But now that shit, that shit is done with, it's over. What Somebody gonna be house hopping, all right? They're gonna be uh, if they house hopping, that means that they're gonna be homeless. It says here that rejection is divine protection. So for some of y'all, look, we got freezer spell too. So they put you in a freezer, okay? They wrote your name down, your date of birth, whatever, and they put you in the freezer. And this was to keep you stuck, all right? Look at it right here, to keep you stuck, like basically like freeze you, you know, so you don't move forward, okay? Again, going back to them holding on to your energy, not wanting you to move forward because if you move forward, you're going to continue to level up and you're going to be in your purpose and your north, north node, your purpose. They don't want that. That's the, that's the mission to block you from getting to your north node. That's the goal for them, okay? So... This connection not working out, friend, family, lover, is actually divine protection, Spirit is saying, okay? So that's what they're telling you here. Let this person get their karma. Let everything play out. Yeah, they've been trying to cock block, you know, trying to block you from leveling up. So let everything play out, okay? Spirit is saying you had an inkling about this person or the situation. You were suspicious about them. This is your confirmation. Trust your intuition as you move forward, all right? So that's what I got here, y'all. I hope I was able to help. Stay woke.